All right, YouTube, the uh, thing I want to talk about today is lunchbox. You know, if you're um, someone who's into fitness and working out, you know the importance of meal preparation and bringing your stuff with you. Um, so a lot of the bags out there right now are ISO bag, six pack bag, etc. And there's absolutely nothing wrong with those. Um, I have a very expensive six pack bag right here. Um, it's nice for the fact that it, um, has these individual compartments for you to put your food in and it comes with this type of wear and it has the spots for the um, cool bags to go, you know, the ice bags to go. It's nice, um, but it's, this is an expensive bag and um, the problem with some of like the ISO bag and the six pack bag, the smaller ones, is they're not as durable. I've heard that from a lot of people that they break them in a year or two, uh, the zippers, the, the cloth, etc. So I want to show you this lunch bag right here. You can pick it up at Home Depot for $19 and some change. Uh, so plus tax, you're looking at barely over $20. Um, it is a great bag. As you can see, it's big. It holds this uh, 1.5 liter water bottle and it holds this shaker bottle all the way. I mean, there's plenty of space down here so you can even fit a taller one. So that's great. It has two compartments that um, are insulated. And I want to show you how big and deep this compartment is. Here are the Tupperware from the six pack bag. Uh, let's see, I'm going to put one in there. I'm going to put two, three, four, and I probably could even get five in there. Yep, I could get five to the very top. And there's actually space over here that you can put your ice packs down the side or on top, just depending on how you want to put your ice bags. Uh, ice packs. So as you can see it holds quite a bit. Uh, so this would be equivalent to the, like a three meal from six pack or ISO. Uh, but what I like to do is I, I normally like to put my food in this size Tupperware. This is actually just from a takeout Asian food place around here. But you can get these disposable ones. I want to say this is 16 ounces. Uh, and this fills the whole bottom base of it. But it will fit it. So you could easily fit Mm, probably three to four of those and that goes the whole length of the base uh, so you could put the ice packs on top so it's great for storing your food this compartment here I've got some protein bars and some other little things but like I said it's insulated the zippers are very heavy duty the strap I mean this metal is pretty thick and then you flip it on over and this has a non insulated section back here you can put your napkins and utensils it has a very nice handle it's got like a like a gel or some kind of padding in there it's very nice um, so i wanted to just show you guys this uh, awesome buy from home depot for 19 dollars. i dare you find another lunch box for 20 dollars or under that's this nice send me a message i'll, I'll post it up I'll, I'll let people know about it but i think this is the deal of the century it's got very um, heavy duty materials and that's one of the reviews I got online from this is this is for like construction workers. It's for people who, uh, you know, work outdoors, who put, put it through abuse and it's got a nice uh, warranty on it as well. Um, yeah, three year warranty and it is also BPA and 100% lead free. So any Home Depot, check it out folks. This is my new favorite lunchbox and I'm going to start using it tomorrow. Take it easy. All right, YouTube, the uh, thing I want to talk about today is lunchbox. You know, if you're um, someone who's into fitness and working out, you know the importance of meal preparation and bringing your stuff with you. Um, so a lot of the bags out there right now are ISO bag, six pack bag, etc. And there's absolutely nothing wrong with those. Um, I have a very expensive six pack bag right here.